Wait, which one is it? Is it oh that corner God. one? <gasps> oh my God! Don't! <laughs> Okay. You just do a house and you really want to cry. <laughs> so this is my kitchen. Dude, I would live here. <laughs> we found our forever home. This is like staying at the Ritz. I've never stayed at the Ritz. I imagine it's nice. It sounds nice. I cannot shout this any louder to the universe. This is my dream house and I want to live here so much more than anything else. I remember it just like yesterday when I first met you at work in 2014. Who knew what the universe could do? From two rings and two I do's on June 5th, 2021, to having our two beautiful babies, Onyx and Araya. With every step we take, the stars align. With every moment that goes. Good morning, guys. Just woke up in our new unit joke. <laughs> joke lounge. Guys, do you remember where we are? Do you recognize this place? This is the unit that we've bought. Woo! Well, technically it's not. Technically it's the show home to the unit that we've bought in McKinley Hill in BGC. How cool is this place? Sometimes I just like to come here and sleep and hopefully the security guard doesn't see me. And then I wake up and I've technically manifested living here. That's not true. As you know from today's title of the video today, we are gonna go property hunting again here in the Philippines. We are yet to find our forever home location. We've toured Cavite, we've toured the Gaitai, we've even been to Boracay. So today we're gonna to be trying a brand new area for the first time. This place has been recommended so many times by so many of you. We've actually booked two property viewings today. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we're gonna be able to take you guys with us and show you the actual properties, like inside the properties. We did a video recently when we went to Cavite and the houses though were insane. It was like Beverly Hills of the Philippines. Apparently this place that we are viewing today is gonna blow that out of the park. So stick around guys, watch until the end of this video. This is gonna be a good one, and I really want you guys to come along and experience it through our eyes as we're gonna see it. I'm gonna try my best to film everything today. We don't have the kids. I'm on a really good vibe because we literally just came in to our unit before we've come today. We have some friends here who are also considering investing in the Philippines. So we took them to meet Cyril, our agent, and she's talking them through the, the pricing plan and whatnot. And guys, there is hardly any units left. And I'm just being in this unit right now, I'm so grateful that we actually invested when we did. We I love this unit so much. Just sneak preview again. Can you just imagine it? Like we wake up in the morning, we have breakfast over there. Come and sit down on our sofa. Oh, you weren't meant to see that. <laughs> see you tomorrow. I'll probably see you tomorrow. Yeah, Bye. You. See you, Sarah. Bye bye. Okay, guys, we're off now. Taxi's here. Ooh, I'm excited. Kim, what's the area called that we're going? Yeah, the Alabang. Alabang. Alice Nadayo. Oh, this is nice. It smells rich. It 
smells great. <laughs> We're coming from the pools. Okay, guys, we found our forever home. <laughs> oh my god, this is my dream house. Oh my god, I actually want this house. I love the kitchen. I love the kitchen. Uh, we'll, I'll show this later. This okay. is where the staff quarters. Oh, staff quarters. Tom, this is amazing. Like this island is so good because, like, you have all your drawers underneath. Look at that door as well. Can we just appreciate this front door? Do you know what it, do you know what it is? Do you know what it is? That's door goals. That is front door goals. Interior black and white, yeah. so it almost feels like We're this back. is home. That's what it is. Like, wow, guys, it just keeps going. Oh, I love this little mezzanine. <gasps> Look at that. Seating area or like yeah. a, what's it called? We a nook, a nook. Take a deep breath. Okay. Because I feel like this is gonna sell it for you right now. Okay. Three. okay. Wait, 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 wait. Let me do it. Okay. Come on. This is a walking bus. Oh. Wow. 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 <laughs> oh. Oh wow, I love this. Do you know I love it? It's so bright as Do you well. know, you know the light wood and yes. the white, that's... Guys, I want this house. I want this house. You can tell if they're good doors when they don't slam. It's good. Yeah. Look at this. Wow. So this one is separate the family room. Guys, we've seen two floors so far, and I didn't even know, but there's a third floor to it, so we're just heading up to the last floor. Wait, this feels like a loft, like a loft conversion, you know? Oh, this is so dope. Oh, this is so good. So weird. So if you have kids here, like, who's watching TV downstairs? You know what? It's one of the things that we've been looking for actually when we've been looking for a property out here is like good natural lighting and a few of the places that we viewed they really didn't have that however this place like has just got like the best lighting all the way around every single room that you're in there's just these huge windows it's so perfect it's brand new as well it's like it feels brand new like no one's really lived here yet it's beautiful guys Look at this view. Look at this view. Feels like a really nice community around here as well. The drive-in was so nice. Oh. Just wait, I'm just gonna just have a minute where I pretend I'm living here. Mm. You gotta live that, you know. This is it guys, this is the goal. I, I don't even know how much this house is. I imagine it's a lot. It's so perfect for us. This would be perfect for our family. Like it's close within range of like schools, amenities, everything we'd want to do with the kids. It's not too far away from Manila, uh, from BGC, so we can still get back to like, you know, that city life. We're not too far away from it. I love it. And it doesn't feel like too countryside. It doesn't feel too secluded. You still feel like you are part of a community, which I really want. And you also feel like, you know, you've got that space. Oh, I love it. And like, guys, do you know what? This house is really close by. Like, literally, that's within 20, 15 feet away. But it doesn't feel like you're overlooked because there's trees all around as well. So I really like it. Oh, I want to live here. We've just checked out the top floor. This is like the the mezzanine level which goes down to what we would probably use as like a family living space down there. The pool is just outside this side. Now the top two floors, the ground floor is the kitchen. Uh, what you've seen earlier, where you walk in, there's the kitchen, like a living room, a dining room. 
the next floor up is exactly the same as the floor above that. There's two rooms either side to like a hallway. And we've just been told by Kuya that there's actually even a basement level to this property, which we didn't know. So we're gonna head down there and check that out now as well. I think it's like the staff living quarters. You know, you just view a house and you really wanna cry <laughs> because you want it so much. Like this is honestly, guys, I cannot shout this any louder to the universe. This is my dream house and I want to live here so much more than anything else. I just feel, I just get such a good vibe about it. Honestly, it just fills me with like happiness. I could just cry. I get like quite emotional when I, when I go in like a really big house like this because for me, that's like what life is all about. Not just getting a big house, but actually like working towards like a dream and a goal or something that you truly want and then actually making it happen is, a, is like huge, it's everything. So the first step of making that happen is viewing it and manifesting it. And that's why I'm so excited today because this is the first step into making that decision. Where has everyone gone? I am lost. Hello? Guys, look at this. I feel like I've got the place to myself now. Hello. Hey, uh, oh, there you are. <laughs> I was like, where's everyone gone? Oh. So this is my kitchen. Dude, I would live here. <laughs> this is so sick. And then this is the nice bedroom with <gasps> their own bathroom. And I'm walking wardrobe. <laughs> Guys, the maids have their own walking wardrobe in this house. I would kind of want to make this like a well, lad's pad. Like, <gasps> yeah. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. Don't look at this. Oh, there's, more there's more rooms. Oh my god. This is the maid's quarter. Huh? There's more. I'm lost again. Guys, I'm lost again. I keep getting lost in this place. I'm lost again. There's more. You know, like, I like the drive house, you've got a drive house, mate. No. <laughs> you feel like you have, you have this in the middle as well. Wow. Yeah. Like, they have their kitchen and everything in the middle, so it feels like they have their own space. Yeah, they're all my cool quarters. This is the first, like, area we've seen that, you know, it just feels right. And also, Kim, like, what have we been saying? We've been saying, like, white houses, black door frames and, yeah. and touches and little finishing Something pieces with greenery. And, guys, literally, just look at this. Every house is ticking the, the box. The structures are so beautiful. Look at that house. Oh. We just viewed the first property, and it has just blown us all away. It was, like, four floors, technically. There was a basement level, two floors, and then this top floor as well, which was the same as the second, sort of. <laughs> They were just so beautiful. I'm so excited and happy that we got to film in the first one. We went there expecting that we might not be able to, but guys, we got to take you along with us. So this must be it. We're in a little cul-de-sac now. Wait, which one is it? Is it that corner one? Oh my god! Don't! Guys, okay. We'll be like 28 again, okay? Here we go. Thank you, Is you need to see this house. I feel like I'm in LA. I feel like I'm in LA. Like, both houses look like Los Angeles homes. Yeah, wait. The structure, the exterior, the color, the materials. Oh yeah, how nice is the that? The detailing of the stone. Yeah. Cool, yeah, how much is this one? Okay, this wait, wait, you have to wait for the door. Oh wow, we love oh, a good door. Oh my god. Very good door. Oh. The tree. The tree, yeah, is, the tree. Is that the money tree? Yeah, we call it a money tree. Looks like somewhere else, doesn't it? Yet, nor have I seen photos of this property, guys. Oh my god, the wall! I feel like I'm in an ice rink. Wow. 
Wow. <laughs> What do you think? It's amazing. <laughs> wow, okay. So this one means swimming pulled in. Okay, this is This is gorgeous. The back. You could turf this. Yeah, yeah actually. Outdoor turf yeah. section. You could. That's the master bedroom downstairs. Oh, yeah. downstairs. Okay, so the master bedroom is literally right by the entrance. And then it's there. So this okay. one then? That's the bedroom, let's wow. see. Oh yes. Oh look at look at the effect on the from the tiles. Look how cool that is. Oh my Wow. Oh this is beautiful. How nice is this bathroom? This is so beautiful. I feel like I'm in a hotel. Yeah. Imagine just waking up and li think living in a hotel style. Look home. at the stones. I need stones around my bath immediately. This is such a good idea, but Onyx might just throw them all in the toilet. <laughs> yeah, that glass is getting smashed. <laughs> Onyx is in here. This is the thing. He loves stones at the moment. Yeah. This is the master bedroom. It's downstairs. Kind of not as big as the last one. But then you've got this huge room just off the side of it, which would be used as a walk-in closet. And then the bathroom, oh wow. This is like staying at the Ritz. I've never stayed at the Ritz. I imagine it's nice, it sounds nice. <laughs> guys, I wanna live here. Look at this living room though, guys. How cool is this? Oh my God, look at that high ceiling. So apparently, the, I think the owners of this, or at least the, the architect who put this house together, was Korean and built it in like a very Korean style. So when you come in, you have this really cool sort of porch area. I'm not, I'm not sure what the term is, but you take your shoes off, there's like these little flip-flops, waiting flip-flops. I sound so like ridiculous. <gasps> Guys, this is so fancy. And then right through here, so this is the living room. You walk into the living room area. Master bedroom is just off there. There's like this really cool, I don't know, kind of reminds me of a bit like Squid Games. You know, this like little, it's, you're in like a container, but that's the dining room. And then these guys have gone through to the kitchen, which I've not seen yet. Wow, this is a lovely kitchen. <gasps> guys, look at this kitchen. Look at this kitchen. Oh, wow. Don't. Oh my, oh my, it smells brand new. Can we add though? Uh, let's see. Is it for your oven? Oven. Oh, it's an oven. Wait, can you do that again? Wait, hang on, this is like, oh, it's going quiet. this is so the light one. there's a speaker here and... Uh, <gasps> Who would like to charge their phone? <laughs> That'll be the first thing you just like oh, show off wow. to your guests. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> This is the kind of level I need to be at right now. <laughs> this is a nice kitchen. Is it just a full, a proper full island? So yeah. not breakfast? I think, yeah. if I'm honest, on, just on, to say on camera, I do prefer the last place because it felt more open and like it's off. Yeah. But this is very like no, normal styled standard. house that you're used to with rooms separated, isn't yeah. it? You know how stairs work. Then you go up there. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. It's a nice space. That's like a front door. Where does that go to? To Narnia. <laughs> Where does that go to? Wow. The bath, they've got the bathrooms all on point. They've each got like a theme. What do you think? Like, it's so beautiful. I love the outside, but I don't have that same feeling as the first house. Like, yeah. the first house for me just 
was everything. I'm not getting that same feel, but it's still beautifully structured, yes. and the outside is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, it's sectioned up into rooms, yeah. whereas the other one felt very open. Plan. Very open, yeah. And obviously with the open floors, you can like go on the balcony and oversee the outside. And I feel like it felt more LA home. And that's a real big inspiration for me when designing my own house is to have that kind of LA vibe, which I really love. And everything, like you said, felt more open. Yeah. Especially with like the family room and everything. <laughs> yeah, so. And this one is actually 15 million, 15 million more. What? Than the first one. Okay, let's see the first bit. Wow. It's, it's really good to uh, stay here during the night. Wow, okay. This is so nice. We even have a jacuzzi up here. Oh no, but all your neighbours will see. <laughs> but this is really lovely because you can come out and just watch the kids ride their bikes outside. So this is kind of like a big balcony area, and like an outdoor seating area, which is really cool. Just about to go and see what's around to make sure that there's coffee shops, grocery <laughs> store, a park close by. Because obviously we really need to make sure that there's some outdoor space for Onyx. As you guys saw from the first house, I absolutely love the house, but there's not enough outdoor space. So we just need to see what's around here. But what I do love is that it just feels really safe and the roads are super wide. And I was just saying that I would love my golf cart here <laughs> to drive around in my golf cart going to Starbucks so yeah this for me so it's quite similar to West Grove you guys know that I loved West Grove because it was up in the mountains and it was also quite easy to get to Alabang is still it's actually much closer it was like a 30 minute was it 30 minutes Tom yeah, well, yeah 30 minute drive um, but also you still have the greenery the wider roads the community feels super safe and I feel like I love the houses here so much more. So this, I can imagine our family living here. And you know, that's like the main thing is to kind of see if it just feels right and it really does. So today I feel like has been a success.